Hey, fishy people. Um, got the packages in the mail just a second ago. So I thought I'd open them up on camera because it should be fun. Uh, first up, I'll do the big one. And this is, or should be, a bunch of shrimp. Just a sec. Um, got these guys from the shrimp tank. Uh, you know, seen pictures of them online. They they look like beautiful shrimp. Got a great deal. Real nice guy. I was dealing with. So I'm excited. I actually forgot kind of what I got myself. So, um, in here should be crystal reds, grade S through SSS. I got some blue diamonds, some blue diamond coals, and some carbon release. And let's see what they look like and how they ship. Uh, great looking packaging. <clears throat> And they're lively. Uh, everything got shipped in cordon breather bags. These look like the blue diamond coals. I've got some crystals. Also nice and lively. Carbon really is, ah, oh, those are beautiful. I, I really am um, doing a bad job filming this. Uh, I've been really looking forward to these guys. Let me see if I can get them up close in the bag. One sec. Those are some pretty shrimp. Even after transport, you know, most, most shrimp go really drab during transport, like these crystals. They're, they're nice looking crystals, but they're, um, you know, their white's not in, and I expect that to, to whiten up a little bit more, but they were just transported. These guys are just gorgeous. I'm excited about that. Very pretty shrimp. And a lot, a lot of blue, you know, you can get carbons in, uh, you can get carbons in, in black and blue. And, uh, I, I think they're both amazing looking shrimp. I, I, I couldn't say that I have one preference over the other. But I want to say that the blues are more desirable, I believe, in the industry. And these are are almost all, they're all blue. I shouldn't say almost. They're, they're really nice looking. That's more of the carbons. Um, I like how we package these, all, all the tiny little packages. That's a lot safer than just one big one. Those are more of the crystals. And uh, so far, he's shipping this with Subwasser Tang. Subwasser Tang, also known as Pelia, same thing. Uh, Java Moss and these ones. So something for them to hold on to. Oh God, those are those are gorgeous. These are um, the uh, blue diamonds. Those are some really nice. Did I pile for those? No, it's the first one. Those are some really nice looking blue diamonds. Yeah, I'm excited. <clears throat> uh, make sure there's nothing in any of this. These are gonna be. Oh, are these all labeled? Yeah, he totally labeled these. So, I don't have to be guessing, but yeah, that was going to be my guess, is Blue Diamond Coals. That's good. Um, blue Diamonds. That's funny, I didn't see the labels earlier. But it's, it's pretty obvious, you know, these 
that's definitely straight up high grade blue diamonds. Those are really pretty. Let me get a close up. Pretty, pretty shrimp. Um, I don't know if you can see them, but yeah, that those are those are real pretty. And uh, that's all of them. So it should be. Um, let me these. Is there, what is it? Carbon release, I got 15 and 15 for 30 total. These guys, 15 and 15 for 30 total. 15 and 15 for 30. Yep, I got 120 shrimp here. And I'm gonna start acclimating them. Uh, which I, I, I drip everything, so. I'm gonna hook up drip lines to all my tanks after I pH test the water. I wanna say I have most of these pretty close, but if I need adjusting, I've got um, this tank at a higher pH, this tank at a lower pH, so I can, or this whole system at a lower pH, so I can, you know, do a water change and, and adjust that. But I'm gonna start dripping these and then I will give you guys an update. Um, Borrowed a camera because I, I need to learn how to use it, and so I might I might throw in some nice pictures. I was trying to get a picture of my of my nice cherries, but uh, yep. Um, I'll, I'll keep adding to this. So hold on. I to totally forgot that I, I had a second package. So excited about getting only shrimp in. They they shipped amazing. Um. I'm totally blanking on this guy's name, and I feel really bad about that. Let me let me look it up because he's a he's a good guy. I had a pleasure doing business with him. Um, just looking at my computer real quick. Found him on the Planted Tank, uh, which is PlantedTank.net. Great forum. Uh, on the forum he goes by Oblong Shrimp. And I don't know, maybe he doesn't want to name out, so, so I'll leave it at that. But um, this other package, this is from food, from a, another, another one of on the tankatank.net and I, uh, she, she was offering sample packages, whoops, I didn't realize they were all loose, but that's cool, um, sample packages of some, of some high grade food, and I, I, honestly, I'm, I'm not super crazy into all the names and brand names and all that stuff, but I want to say there's like, is Monsura one, and some salty shrimp, I don't, I don't know, but, um, it's their 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 blends, which is what I wanted because I, I haven't tried any like designer stuff, and uh, until I was excited about that, you know, I got I got a couple of these, and that's what they these guys are gonna be munching on along with the shrimp I already have. Um, I'm pretty lazy when I normally feed my shrimp. I, I give them algae wafers and flake food and lettuce once in a blue moon, but I'm pretty lazy. So so hopefully you know this will make them better or something not that they weren't good to begin with but uh i'll see you guys in a bit one sec okay real quick finish to this video because my camera's running out of batteries um this is the next day i, I let these guys sit in here overnight because they were just squirming like crazy and you couldn't see any of them but i got carbon release in this tank uh you kind of see them moving around should have put a piece of food in there so they're all up front I've got my blue diamonds down in this tank. I need to clean these soon. Um, my high grade cherries, uh, painted fire reds in here. I've got the crystals in this tank right here. Uh, most all these tanks are around the same parameters except this one. Um, he was keeping his shrimp at uh, pr pr pretty, pretty acidic water, so I had to tamper with that a bit. Got blue diamonds in here. You can see them running around the bottom right now. And actually, you can see them all over. Hopefully, you can see those all over. 
Uh, blue diamond coals in here. Kind of surprised. I, I was expecting more, um, more kind of blondes and chocolates, but some of these are actually really red, like that guy. And I didn't realize they got so red. Um, but yep, that, that's, you know, them in the tanks. I'm going to spend the rest of today filling up this bottom section. It might make, take me a bit to, to get these top five, but I'm not in that big of a hurry. This bottom section I want to get filled because I am going to be separating my crystals out. Um, at least into a few different groups. And I will probably separate some of the blue diamond coals as well, as there are some that are pretty close to a blue diamond, uh, a nice blue diamond, and there are some that are pretty far off. So I, I might separate those also. Uh, but that's the shrimp project. Um, got just a couple pictures of the shrimp from yesterday. I didn't try and take any today because I'm trying to get this, this video out and I just haven't had time. And uh, I'm actually having a hard time getting this camera working the way I want. Which is probably just my fault. I'm not used to it. Uh, but hope your tanks are doing well. I will see you guys later and I will keep you updated. Have a great day. Bye.